Hello, guys. In this lesson, we're going to talk about adding a Messenger call to action button on your page. Let's get started. Your Facebook page can be discovered by your potential customers as they search for keywords that could match your page information or keyword phrases that you have included in your posts. Consumers who are interested in your brand's niche might discover your page and check out your products. On the top section of your page, you can set a call to action button and it's one of the first things that your customers will see on your page. This button will entice your page visitors to click on the button depending on the action that you have set. If you haven't set a call to action button on your Facebook page yet, this is what you will see. Click add a button. You will see a pop-up window to choose from the list of actions that you want your page visitors to take. There are different actions that you can choose from, such as follow your page, start order where people can be redirected to a website where they can order your food, book now for setting appointments, call now, which is available on the mobile messenger app, message your page, or even shop now. Choose to send message so that your page visitors can easily click on this button, send you a direct message on your page, and engage with your brand. Next. You will see a pop-up window showing you frequently asked questions. You can add common questions that you may notice people are asking you about your business, then add a response that you want your visitors to receive for a particular question. Take note that this is only accessible to the admins of the Facebook business page. The default question that you may also use right away is anyone available to chat. A pre-filled answer that you have set will be shown in this text field. You can edit the answer in this text field or leave it as is. Also, you can add more questions for your viewers to choose from. Once a user chooses an option from the frequently asked questions that you have set, the other questions will no longer be available for them to access. Make it a goal to respond to messages within 24 hours so that you will later gain the badge of very responsive to messages. This badge can entice potential customers to engage with your business since they know that they can expect a response from their inquiries right away. Consumers nowadays are always looking for fast transactions for their purchases. Here are some Facebook pages that have a send message call to action button set up on their page. If you click on the button, the chat window will pop up and you may notice a few questions that are set up for customers to choose from. Anyone can choose from these questions, which are common to be asked by anyone interested in your business. As a page owner, you can set an automated reply like in this example. As a question is chosen, the automated response set by this page is saying that they are grateful for their message and informing them that they have received their message as well. The recipient can expect their response as soon as possible. This is much better compared to sending a message without a response from the business page. Adding a send message call to action button on your Facebook page will help encourage your page visitors to start conversations with your business. You can set questions that are common to be asked about your business. If you have set these frequently asked questions on your page, your viewers can get the information that they will need from your business without waiting for hours for your response. They can even send follow-up questions as they receive an automated response from your business. Now that you know about adding a messenger call to action button on your page, we can now proceed to the next topic, get messages from posts on pages. I'll see you there. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and go to technicforce.com for more tools and training.